Hey y'all, Fresh Met here from IBM Engineering. Today, I'm going to show y'all how to create diagrams in Doris Next, like the Hummingbird one. To do that, go inside of a module and click the big blue Create button inside the top left and click Diagram and Sketches. This will open up a new window for us to put a name for the sketch and I'll just put Test. We can select which artifact type we want it. For this demonstration, I'm just going to leave that as the default type. We can also select what the artifact format is, and it's going to be a diagram in this case. If templates were made for the project, we could use a template for this diagram, and you can also select the folder that you want it to be saved in, and you can customize some tags. Also, you can check off to open the artifact or not. I'm just going to leave everything as, as it is, so I will hit on OK. This will take one second to open. Here's a little menu that is explaining some diagram tips. If you don't want to show it again, you can click that checkbox down below. But I like this popping up, so I'm just going to click on OK. To get started, you have this menu over here on the right-hand side of the screen. Just scrolling through it, you can see there's a whole bunch of different options. I'm just going to show a basic demonstration. So I will click and drag over a square and a circle. I can modify these shapes however I want to. I can make them bigger, I can make them smaller, but I'm just going to enlarge that a little bit. And to type text inside of it, all I need to do is just double click and I can type in any characters that I want to. If we want to connect up these two shapes, all you need to do is click on one of them, mouse over to this baton looking symbol, click on it, and drag it to where you want it to attach to. Some other stuff that we can do. When we click on the shape, we can change the style of the shape and the text inside of it. We can also go over to Insert, click Image, and you can paste images from inside the project. So here is our Hummingbird drone. Some other stuff that we can do is if you click on Options, you can turn on and off the grid, the guidelines, and a very interesting feature is you can select the theme that you want. So we're going to select Bright, click OK, and now these shapes change colors. We can also zoom in and out, and you can do some other modifiers up on the top here. If we want to, we can put a description, so I will type in test sketch. It's always a great idea to fill out description as much as possible, so if anyone has any questions or anything, they can hop right and take a look at the description. Some of the stuff that you can do is you can add comments, you can link this artifact to other things, and you can also put where it has been used at. But for now, all that I'm going to do is click on save and done. Hopping out of this, I'll show you all that it is right here inside of the module. If you all have any other questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me on LinkedIn. You can find me at Brett Charmet.